Senator Kamala Harris of California is being condemned for leading an attempt to smear Supreme Court nominee Brett Kavanaugh, this time with a deceptively edited video of a portion of his Senate confirmation hearings. The California Democrat tweeted an edited video of Kavanaugh's response to Texas Senator Ted Cruz's questions about the judge's 2015 dissent from denial of hearing in bank in the case of Priests for Life v. HHS The case involved Priests for Life's lawsuit against the federal government over Obamacare's contraceptive mandate provision. The pro-life organization ultimately appealed the decision of the U.S. Court of Appeals for the D.C. Circuit, which upheld the Obama administration's accommodation for religious employers who objected to being forced by the government to provide free contraception, sterilization procedures, and abortion-inducing drugs to employees through health insurance plans. The accommodation required faith group employers that objected to the mandate to notify the federal government of their objection by filing a form. The Department of Health and Human Services HHS, was then to arrange for the same coverage of the same services with the employer's insurance company, rather than the employer himself. It's clear that in his testimony to Senator Cruz, Kavanaugh was repeating the words that the plaintiffs had used in their own briefs. To say that because Kavanaugh accurately characterized the plaintiff's position he himself believes that contraceptives are abortion-inducing drugs demonstrates a complete misunderstanding of the priests for life litigation, as well as Kavanaugh's testimony yesterday. Still, Harris persisted in her narrative by stating, there's no question that he uncritically used the term abortion-inducing drugs, which is a dog-whistle term used by extreme anti-choice groups to describe birth control. Women have every reason to believe their health and their lives are at stake, Lagans continued with the narrative. Let me break it down for you, Brett. Birth control is basic health care. Birth control allows women to plan their futures, participate in the economy, and, for some women with health issues like endometriosis, allows them to get through the day. What Judge Kavanaugh also understands, and many of his objectors do not, is that it is not the role of the court to judge the accuracy or credibility of a citizen's religious beliefs, but to protect the citizen's freedom to hold and live those beliefs, Ravone added. That is what he did in the Priests for Life case, and that is one of the countless reasons he should be confirmed to the Supreme Court.